in today's episode. A truck will increase the global temperature by 0.01 degrees, a bus will do whatever buses do, and a Fiat will be thick. Since most tractors have diesel engines, which usually have a high torque and low RPMs, it's not impossible to do a wheelie with them. By the way, this is not an oil leak, but a valve dumping water. Florida man strikes again. One of the few racing categories that can come close to a Formula 1 car is the LMP1 category. Here is a modified LMP1 car, the Porsche 919 EVO, destroying the Nürburgring lap record. This footage is not sped up by the way. Front-wheel drive cars can do a lot of things better than rear-wheel drive cars. Parallel parking is one of these things. Here is a turbocharged 2008 Mustang doing a pull. What weighs over 2 tons is more expensive than a house and can drift? Correct, a Rolls Royce. Do you want your car to spit flames? Just remove your exhaust manifold. Hungary has pretty interesting trains. No hill is too steep for the Nissan Patrol. Some roads are closed for semi-trucks for obvious reasons, but there are still truckers out there that just don't care. And this is the result. In Estonia, there is a uphill drag racing competition series. Basically, it's mostly all-wheel drive cars competing against each other by going up a snowy hill. Someone has been playing too much GTA recently, or we mentioned drive. <laughs> what happened, Drifter? What happened? Tell us. Fuck, I lost it. <laughs> <laughs> now, what are we gonna do? I'll, I'll... Who would win the fastest downshift competition? A automatic transmission or Robert Kubica in his 2007 Formula 1 car? Congratulations, you've made it halfway through the video. Consider subscribing and help me reach 500,000 subscribers this year. Thank you. Imagine being a pedestrian and seeing this Honda Civic driving past you at night. This company is building roll bars for the Miata. To prove their robustness, they dropped a Miata shell on the roof from 5 meters. This is how the new IMCA C8 Corvette sounds like in action. In one of the first episodes of this series, I showed you a Fiat 500 with a Lamborghini V12. This time it is also a Fiat 500, but with a 3.0-liter Ferrari V8. 
It has been built completely from the ground up and it is an absolute beast. Nothing to see here, just a massive Detroit diesel powered Kenworth truck doing a fat burnout. This guy discovered a way to lose a lot of money in a short period of time. This is a Mazda RX-2 drag racing car with 4 rotors and 4 turbos. Remember, no matter how fast your lawnmower is, there's always this guy that has built a faster one. Good news everyone, there's a Dacia Duster that has been modified to compete in the Pikes Peak Hill Climb competition. Did I mention that it is powered by a Nissan GTR engine? A few episodes ago, I showed you the velocity stack. Here it is again, but this time it is more friendly to your ears. You can make almost any car sound like the classic Subaru Boxer engine. All it takes is to change the equal length headers to unequal lengths, just like this Honda Civic owner did. These guys thought for a moment that their troubles are over. That's everything for today. All sources are in the description. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. That doesn't make sense.